So, what do you want to talk about? Hmm. Well, um, <clears throat> when you raised your hand, what was on your mind? Yeah, I, I love helping people, and um, I do it a lot, and I love my work so much. Um, and wondering if it's, I mean, it's okay to not really know what the next step is and to just feel good while you don't know. It's even better. Okay. It's even better. Okay. Because if, if you are following the impulse, then you're following the path of least resistance and the path of least resistance will take you to what you want, but it'll be a joyful path every step of the way. And it's constantly unfolding. And mm -hmm. so in fact, a determine if you can leave aside the determination to need to know everything, mm -hmm. you'll be way happier Okay. and you will, you will receive on a moment to moment basis, more rich experiences. Mm -hmm. Sometimes you miss the writing on the wall altogether, even though it's right there, you miss it. Mm -hmm. You miss the clues because you're so busy trying to see the big picture that you miss the details of the little picture. Mm -hmm. You miss the details of the now picture, mm -hmm. the poignant now. Do you know, and this is always going to be true. You're not ever going to feel you're not ever going to feel in the future. You're only going to feel in the now and your determination to know all the details of the future, which you can't possibly know makes you feel bad in the now. So just get into that general place. Mm -hmm. Esther has a placard. She puts it on the dashboard of her car. It reflects back on the window. You can't read it when you look at it, but when you put it in the, on the dashboard, it reflects and it says, things are always working out for me. That's all you need to know. Mm -hmm. Things are always working out. Mm -hmm. Things are always working out. Not things have worked out or things will work out. Things are working out. And don't, do you want to miss any of the are working are part, the are part? Mm -hmm. Do you really want you there? Have you, do you ever say, wake me when it's over? <laughs> you don't, you don't want to miss it. You don't want to miss it. You want to feel the pleasure of the closing of that gap every step along the way. Mm -hmm. You're getting this. Yeah. Um, what about, there's been times where I've thought reincarnation, like learning, uh, or having someone like take me back and finding out because I've had such hugely profound God relationships, you know, um, my ex-husband, when, 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 when you go back like that and the, what you're calling those regressions, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. we don't know if you're getting your past life or somebody else. Okay. 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 But we do know you're getting something that accurately matches the vibration you got going on right now. That's all that's happening. Okay. It would be like going back and dreaming a whole lot of dreams okay. or be like, it would be like somebody getting the vibe of you and then dragging you to every movie that represented the character that you play right now. Okay. Not who you used to be, not who you will be, who you are right now, who you are right now, who you are right it just now. Just takes you out of the now. Yeah. And, okay. and you get to choose who you are right now with much more Ooh. grace and power than yeah. you've been allowing yourself to realize. Play with it and watch. Deliberately set your tone and watch what comes back to you. That, that really is the game that we want you to play. Enough? Really good. Thank you.